Today we're partnering with the American Cancer Society and the NFL to do the Crucial Catch Day, which is an awareness opportunity for all of our community and, and everybody from the outside as well. Wouldn't want to be anywhere else uh, than right here today and uh, creating awareness and seeing these women drive off in their, in their limo to get their screenings, you know, it's a, it's a good day. And everyone's going to have fun today and create awareness and potentially find cancer sooner and potentially save lives. Uh, the purpose is to get people motivated and educated so that they can do early detection and hopefully prevent any kind of cancer from happening or at least catch it at the earliest stages. It's very important. It's a service that we haven't always had available and now with these partnerships we're able to provide this information and these services and help women get screenings and even men get screenings when necessary. Lots of emotions happened over the 14 months that I received treatment. Today, just over five years later, I am considered NED, no evidence of disease. And we're talking about the importance of women getting mammograms early so they have that crucial catch of catching their possible breast cancer diagnosis early on, which will hopefully lead them to uh, a better happy ending of healthy long-term life. But I'm also here talking about a type of breast cancer called inflammatory that does not present with a lot has skin changes. So we're mirroring these two conversations of early detection with something that shows up late stage without the traditional forms of detection and hopefully we'll have a better educated audience. Breast cancer is a very devastating disease. It's part of my family, which makes it really hit home for me to, to be able to speak about these things and create awareness and potentially the sooner we can find out what's going on, the greater the chances are to, to beat this disease. I hope that you remember women like me and STAR because we want cancer early. We want it stopped. We don't want anyone being told, oh, by the way, Mrs. Arnold, after four months, there's nothing wrong with you. You have about two months to live. And as I always like to say, spoiler alert, I didn't die. Eight years later, I'm without disease. Together, we are going to make something happen for the betterment. We will save lives and we can end cancer. Thank you.